there you go. Finally. Oh yeah, let's craft this bad boy. Bring it back. What's going on guys, it's still here, welcome back to Toronto 9. And yeah, we last left off, we were in the cave I think, or actually were we in the town, I don't really remember. Uh, but guys, I told you that I freaking gonna make craft some stuff. I told you that I will craft some stuff in, 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 in camera, but I crafted the stuff, the stuff off, off camera, but we're gonna craft the mage robe. Uh, yeah. You can get the mage robe I think, by just drop. I don't really know, I think I know where to go, but I think the, the guy that drafted is pretty high level. Let's just craft the mage robe, I guess. Like there's, I just, I freaking like, noticed that there were a katana. Like, I never, when they played Tormund Line, they were never a katana. It's pretty darn sick. Alright. Mage robe. Butterfly wing, pale stone. Let's see here. Uh, butterfly wings. And but to craft this, uh, this stuff, guys, is pretty darn easy. Let's go to blacksmith and go to create equipment and go to staff. And it's called mage road, mage road. I mean, uh, here and it's pretty easy, guys. Go to Nestle Mountain and Lulu Lake. To it's other, it's really easy, guys. Just use your mini map. If you know you have a mini map. Uh, go to world map and you see here over here here there is a lake then there is a mountain here you need to go you need to just pass through the plains and ruin temple and then go to this is a lake and then this is the mountain if you don't know what ruin temple is we went there before like the freaking like golems that have those spears thing is wondering why I got a hat and stuff when I did some off camera, I got some uh, achievements or like uh, badges. I got those, like, I got like three orbs. And yeah, I used, I used it and I got this hat and I got more useless <laughs> stuff. And yeah, I'm gonna go and craft this uh, mage robe. I think first we need to kill the boss. I'm gonna, I'm gonna first kill the boss. Collect five uh, pale stone, I think. Uh, yeah, pale stone, pale ge gemstone. Yeah, pale gemstone. I uh, need five of those. I'm gonna kill off a boss first because the boss can be a bit hard and a bit rare to the pale stone. It's a bit rare to drop. Yeah, I'm gonna do the boss first, then I might kill it a lot. <laughs> and maybe like find a party, and yeah, I'll be back when I'm in the boss area. All right, then we're here, guys. I just need to kill the freaking golem like a billion times now to get the pale gemstone. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. By the way, guys, I I I bought actually I bought the bevel in the if you if you see in the in the spawn in the in spawn of Tormline, line uh, there's like a, a board right you can click in the board and you can like type you can like have those uh, there's a lot of stuff you can like click and go to the materials and then search bevel and you can buy 99 but it's pretty expensive like 5k or 10k to just get a stack uh, and I grinded those rats if you don't know and got a lot of and sell a lot of those metals that the rats dropped and yeah here 99 bevel and that means you can craft a ring but we're gonna do that later but we're gonna, do, we're gonna fight the boss now yeah, we're gonna use this travel gem to get to gain five uh, percent rate drop rate. And let's go. All right, let's do this. Here you go, golem dead. Let's see here. I hope you get. Come on, can you get gems? Nope. Oh god, damn it. We got. Well, golem fragments. We got we can use that material to craft something, I think. God damn it. I think we're gonna, I'm gonna try to get a party. Alrighty then. <laughs> this is sad. No one wants to invite me to a party, but whatever. Let's, let's go. This The boss is pretty easy, but it takes a bit of time to kill it. 
because I'm a bit low level. Well, let's go. Anyways, let's try to defeat this. It's, I can't defeat it, but it takes very long time. We got one, guys. We got one. We got one. Yeah, pale stone. Yeah. And another one. Alright, guys. We finally did it. Ten. Finally got ten pale gemstone. It took freaking forever, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, now we just need uh, those. I mean, to kill those fairies, I think. Yeah, let's go and uh, uh, go and kill them. Right, we're here. The ruined temple town. All right, I'm going to kill Farara, for Farfala, Farfala. Right, then. I think they will be here over here. Yeah, they will. Hello there. We need to get those butter butterfly wings. Well, let's start killing them, I guess. Let's do this. Magic waffle. I don't think they can drop those wings. Those like uh, wings thingies you can equip. Maybe you already saw those in some people that are wearing those. Like they're like for mages. Like wings that you can equip. It's like staff. I don't know, I don't remember what it's called, but it's like staff things. It's not staff, but it's, it's, like, it's like staff, but you wear it in your back and you can fly. They're pretty darn sick, and, they can, and this butterfly can drop it, I think. I think the butterfly can spawn over there somewhere, I think. They can spawn more. Yeah, let's go over there. And let's uh, go. Yeah, they can spawn here, but it's not really a lot, though. It's not really a lot. Before, was the before when I was here, I farmed this butterfly. There were a lot of them, but now they, now they don't. Uh, they just three. You know what? Let's go back to the old place where you farm those farara. For, for, for. For Fala, I mean, for Fala. Alright, let's equip the, our, our sword that we got. <laughs> uh, this sword, by the way, if you go there, over there, you need to go there if you want to ma make the mage rod. Go there and destroy those, like, Things like those rocks, the, the things that look like ice. I don't, I don't remember the names, right? Just kill, kill the, kill a mob that look like ice. <laughs> and yeah, let's go and put this heavy sword and let's, and let's go and make a freaking Adam bloody killing spree. Guys, guys, I got it. I think what I'm talking about, a fe feather, magic feather, whatever you call it. Here it is. It's like, I don't know what to call this. It's like a ring or something, a, a wing. Play some magic feather. And if we equip it, we can have like a wing in the back. It looks pretty sick. Like that. And when you activate it, it will bring out those. Yeah, like this. Can it also now we have like four wings <laughs> because we have this a water wing and another wing. <laughs> and they're pretty good. The attack pretty is freaking kind of fast though. I think I'm gonna use this. Actually, maybe. Oh, we got another one. Nice. They're pretty good for farming because why? If you use this and you use your magic wall. The wall will be much bigger. If you see here, see the wall is much bigger. If you use the normal, if you use a staff, the wall will be smaller. That's why a lot of people use this, like wings. There's a lot. Of, there's different types of wings, like dark element, the lightning element, and then this is like the normal wing. And yeah, some of them look pretty darn sick. But see here, when I cast this, like when I cast the uh, the wing. But when I use a staff and cast a magic wall, 
a minute. And it gets the magic wall. Oh god, what the? Come on, please. Because the magic wall will be like small. Like if I have the wing, it will be triple, triple the freaking Adam like length or the wide. There we go. Now let's get this. Oh, we got, we got, we got a magic feather with a slot on it. Nice. And it gives us 100 MP. That's good attack speed. That's pretty darn good. For right now, let's continue farming this butterflies and get our freaking um, uh, butterfly wings. All right, I think I have 10 now. I freaking hope so. Yeah, we do. Now we can finally craft the mage robe. All right, let's. First thing first, we need to go to spawn. All right, now we can make the pesky little mage robe. We could kill a mob uh, to get the mage robe, but I did it the hard way. <laughs> ah man. But whatever. Let's go and kill. No, no, I mean, let's go craft the mage room. Alright, then I hope we have enough money. I hope so. I don't think we have enough money. <laughs> yeah, we don't have enough money. Actually, we do have enough money, but we don't have enough clothing. That can be fixed. Uh, no, we have some useless stuff we don't need. Yeah, hard skin. Uh, yeah, we just need like. Just need, let's go with 10. Because we need hard skin for something, I think, later on. I don't remember, but maybe. Or maybe not, I don't know. Oh, we need 20! Uh -huh. alright, then we'll go back and get some more freaking butterfly. God damn it. Alright then, I think we, now we have enough freaking materials to make the pesky little uh, uh, mage robe. Uh, where's, uh, there it is. There you go. Finally! Oh yeah, let's craft this bad boy. There you go. And it uh, added defense too. Nice. It added defense too. Very freaking nice. Alright. Now let's uh, uh, put this mage robe. It looks pretty darn sick, it is. Oh yeah, now we're, now we're a true wizard or mage. The girls are mage, right? And the wizard are boys. I think. Yeah, now we're a wizard. <gasps> Ooh, you're a wizard, Harry. Oh my god. Or can a male be a mage? I, I don't know. But well, we did it. We did it, guys. We finally made the mage robe. But, anyways, guys, I'm gonna end this here. And yeah, hope bless you guys. Don't subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya. Oh, <laughs> oh,